Greetings everyone. In this video, I will show you how to install Android apps on Windows 11 using this app, WSA Pac-Man. It is an app with a proper GUI or graphical user interface and it does not need any commands. First of all, to download it, you can check out releases here and download the latest version available. Download the installer.exe from here. So I have already downloaded this file. I will install it now. You can put a check mark here to associate APK file extension with this software. Next and install. And done. Now let's open the app. Now guys, to use this app, you have to have the Windows subsystem for Android. You can see that I have installed it. Now guys, if you haven't installed the Windows subsystem for Android, you can just go to this link. You will find this file in the description with all the links that are required. So just go to this website and then copy this link. Just copy and paste it right here. All right. And then select slow from here and then click this checkbox. Scroll down and you will see this 1.21 GB file. Download this file. I have already downloaded this 1.21 GB file. You can just rename it to WSA so that it will be easy for you to install. Next guys, simply run PowerShell. Please run PowerShell as an administrator. Now from the file attached in the description, you will also get this command. Just copy this command and paste it right here. Now guys, you have to change the path to the WSA file that you have downloaded in the previous step and then press enter and it will install the Windows subsystem for Android. Now when Windows subsystem for Android is installed and you have restarted the computer once, just open this software that is the WSA Pac-Man and then you will see Windows subsystem for Android is turned off. Just turn it on. Now guys, if you see this error that it could not establish a connection with WSA, now simply open the Windows subsystem for Android and now simply just click on continuous. Now just turn on developer mode here. Now even if the error is not fixed, you can just open manage developer settings and this will start the Windows subsystem for Android. Please wait here. All right, now check out. You can see it says connected and successfully connected to WSA. All systems are working. Otherwise, even then if you are seeing errors, you can just open developer options from the manage developer options and then you can just turn on USB debugging from here and then this will fix the error. Guys, before we install an Android app, I want to share that if you are still unable to start the Windows subsystem for Android, we have an option to troubleshoot it. Just open settings, go to apps, go to optional features, scroll down and click more Windows features. This will open Windows features, scroll down, and you have to install the virtual machine platform. Just install it, click OK, and then restart the computer. And then your Windows subsystem for Android will work flawlessly. All right, so guys, now let's try installing an Android app and then see if it opens. Now let's install this APK. Just double click. And then you will see this dialog box, which says, do you want to install this application? Now simply click install. If the install button is not available, you can try an other APK. You can see the app is successfully installed. If you want to create a desktop shortcut, place a check mark here and then you can dismiss or open the app. Now let's open it. And you can see the app is running flawlessly here. All right guys, that's all for this video guys. If you have questions, please ask me in the comment section and I will definitely help you. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye.